Well folks, how's it going? Welcome to Hugh Collective. Hope you're all keeping well, keeping awesome, keeping sweet. I'm at Port Arm train station and I'm heading to Belfast today and I cannot wait to take you guys along, so hopefully you'll enjoy the vlog. Belfast, it is great to be back in you. I just decided to come up here today. I wasn't really doing much today, there was no plans, and I was like, let's go up to the wonderful city of Belfast, let's do some exploring. And here we are, let's go and explore. So I'm here at Belfast City Hall, as I usually go to every single time I go into Belfast. It is such a beautiful structure, so much to see. The history is just absolutely phenomenal, as you can see here. Wonderful, wonderful landmark here in Belfast. So this is what I know is the wee pub street here in Belfast, it's got the Duke of York, it's got the Harp Bar down here and it's also got the Dirty Onion where I'm going to go to and it is the Cathedral Quarter, sixth spot in Belfast if you're looking a good beer, a good chat and it's really great for photographs as well. So it's time to get a wee beer here at the Dirty Onion. I'm gonna get a lager, I believe. So I'm drinking a Blue Ribbon. I've never actually had it before. I've had Red Stripe before, which I think is something similar. I had it in Edinburgh, but let's see what it's like. Very nice, links to the Dirty Onion in the description below. So I picked a very bad day to uh, be wearing shorts because it's absolutely pissing it down now, which is all that you ever wanted. But let's go to the Sailor's Grave, see the folk there and catch up with them. Alrighty folks, how's it going? So I'm in my home away from home at a sailor's grave here in Belfast and I'm actually going to get this recolored, which is going to be absolutely wonderful actually. Really looking forward to it, getting it done by Kayla, so it's going to be absolutely paying. Looking forward to that and look at the view behind me, there's the bus, as you can tell. Um, the vibes here are absolutely perfect. So some of you guys know, in my past I've struggled very badly with mental health issues such as depression, anxiety, stress. Even a few suicide attempts, which has been absolutely awful. But I just need to let you guys know that, uh, unfortunately, my mental health has done a little bit of a relapse. I've done a few things which I shouldn't have, you know, such as taking more medication that was needed, more medication that was necessary. Because I didn't care anymore. I didn't believe in myself anymore. I was just trying to put myself to sleep, and I didn't care, unfortunately, if I didn't wake up. And... It was a very horrible place to be in, but on this channel, I want to be so open about everything. No matter how big or how small, how personal, how non-personal, I want to share it with you guys just to try and lift you up at the same time. But today has been a far better day for me. I've started believing in myself again. I've started feeling more motivated. Went up to Belfast, took myself out of the house, got some fresh city air. Don't know how fresh it is, but it was absolutely wonderful. It was a great day. And I just want to share with you guys, you know, if you're feeling stressed, if you're feeling down, if you're not believing in yourself anymore, which I currently have been feeling, you know, a bit recently, which has been awful, I, I tend to look at it like there's a light at the end of the tunnel, and that light is positive, happiness, excitement, and self-belief, and I'm currently walking through that tunnel at the minute to reach out again, and I've been there before, I know how good it feels, and I'm just so excited to get back into that frame of mind again, and, you know, believe in yourself, you're better than the issues that you face, you're greater than the stresses you have in life. All the problems that you have, try and ignore them. I know that sounds really bad because it's difficult to ignore them, but believe in every single thing you do. Be proud of what you've overcome. Be proud of all the issues that you face and come out on the winning side. And this is another issue that you're gonna come out on the winning side of. A few years ago when my mental health was at its absolute worst, I found refuge in blogs and vlogs, which really lifted me up and gave me the motivation and inspiration to vlog. Like what I'm doing now, and it was absolutely incredible. And I'd just like to personally thank those people, which include Ben Brown, Nicole Eddy, who blogged and now vlogs as well, Steve Booker, Zoella, Alfie Days, Joe Sugg, and Life of Tom and Fun for Louie. I can't remember if I said his name or not, but you guys are absolutely wonderful. The difference that you put in my life has been absolutely amazing. You helped put a smile on my face, which didn't have a smile for a while. And you should be very proud of yourself because thank you so much. And I don't know how in a video I can actually express my thanks, but if this is the way I can do it, this is it. Because thank you so much, guys. You have been absolutely wonderful. You just put a smile on this face. Thank you. So what I'm trying to say is believe in yourself, try and overcome your problems, and you will if you try and stay positive, believe in yourself, admire yourself, be proud of yourself, you will overcome those problems, you will pass that obstacle, and 
a very exciting thing to do and you should be very, very proud of yourself. So that's really all I've been looking to say. Thank you so much guys for watching this vlog. It really means a lot that you've spent your time here watching the Hewitt Collective. So if you liked the video, please give it a big like. That would mean a lot to me. If you want to see more from the Hewitt Collective, please hit subscribe somewhere down there. Comment and let me know what you thought of the video. It was something different and hopefully you'll enjoy it and hopefully you did enjoy it. And if you could share it, that would be absolutely wonderful to try and spread this message of positivity. That would mean a lot. So, guys, thank you so much. This has been quite difficult to say as to why I haven't been my normal happy personality. But thank you so much, guys. Thanks for everything that you do to me and give me a wonderful outlet to express myself. So, guys, thank you so much. I'll see you in a new video real soon. I love you all.